Hi, I'm Anne with Challenge Island. We're a STEAM education program. Um, STEAM stands for Science, Technology, Engineering, Art, and Math. Um, and today we're going to do a little engineering project that you can do at home with your family. Um, we're going to do some mail delivery. Um, mail delivery has been an engineering challenge for hundreds of years. Um, started with horse and buggy and um, since then it's become much more technology enabled. Um, all of those sorting and delivering of the mail. Um, today we're going to use wind power though to get mail to travel within your house. Uh, so a few things you're going to need. You'll need a straw, um, the jumbo smoothie size straw is the best. Um, you'll need some string, some tape, um, a balloon, and some scissors. First thing you're going to want to do is take your straw and cut it into um, a couple of pieces about an inch or two long. And then you'll tape two of them together like we've done here. Um, then you can string a piece of string through the top straw and adhere it to um, two things in your room. You can use two chairs, a door, um, whatever you have available that you can put tape on. Then um, take a piece of paper and write a little note on it and you're going to put your little note in your second straw and that'll be our mail. And since it's Thanksgiving, maybe you write a little note, something you're thankful about. Once you've got that all set up, then you'll we'll take the balloon. I've blown that up in advance. Um, we'll take some tape. And put your tape on your balloon. And tape it around your straws. Make sure it's nice and tight. And once you've got that ready, you can let go. and you've just delivered some mail. So experiment, see how far you can get your mail to travel. Um, see if it travels further, if you blow the balloon up really big, or maybe you try two balloons, um, but have some fun with it. Um, again, I'm Anne from Challenge Island. Uh, we have a lot of great STEAM programming running in December, so check us out, and I hope to see you soon.